If your iPhone is disabled or forget the password, then you restore or erase your iPhone and try to activate. How to create Apple ID and what the important part you have to know while making an ID are all in the video description. Check it out. Then after a few steps, you see the option iPhone lock to the owner. Why did this happen and what is the solution for a fix? If you have an iPhone with Find My iPhone is enabled. Then after you restore or erase your iPhone, then you have to insert the previous owner ID and password. This luck prevents anyone who is not the owner from using this iPhone. If you don't know this ID and password, then no doubt you are getting into trouble. Is there any option to fix that problem? You have two options to fix it. First option, enter the screen password that you use on this iPhone before restoring. For this, below the password option, here you can see, unlock with the password, tap on it. And you have to insert the correct old password two three times. If the passcode is working, then your iPhone is unlocked without inputting the Apple ID and passcode. This is the best option to unlock your iPhone. If you don't know the locked password, then another final option is that you have to insert the correct Apple ID and passcode. Here you can see the iPhone log to owner option is crossed and follow the activation process. If you forget your Apple ID passcode, then you can contact Apple to fix it. If you use any service that is so expensive. So better keep it safe or write it down on a piece of the paper. Your Apple ID passcode that is really big trouble if you forget it and try to recover it without any information. Don't forget to give feedback about the video. Don't forget to share your thought. If that stuff is helpful, then press like and subscribe to support. See you in the next video. See you soon.